Hi everybody. Um, I thought that I would do a really quick haul video on the stuff that I bought yesterday and things that are going to go in my layouts for um, a good chunk of my layouts for next year actually. There's a lot of good stuff here. Um, so first things first, I want to start with these two pieces. They are from a place called Impressive Ideas. If you live in the Atlanta area, you should definitely check it out. I'm filming this on my phone like normal. Um, so it's going to be kind of weird. I'm going to try to focus the best I can on stuff. So the first thing I want to um, talk about are the stamp set from Avery L that I got. I thought this was so stinking cute. Um, definitely something that I'm going to use with some bright washi tape and just being super happy and optimistic about the new year. It was just, just exciting. I just thought it was really cute. Um, plus I really haven't been able to play with this whole like coloring book movement. So I thought this would be something really cute where I could stamp it and color it in and then kind of cut it out and put it in there. Maybe like a sticker, um, or something like that. Um, Banks is probably about to walk through this entire thing, just so everyone knows. Um, so that's a thing always with her. Um, this tape was just priceless. I literally bought it because when I saw the Eleanor Roosevelt quote on it, I knew there was going to just be more awesomeness to come. Plus, you can't really tell because the lighting keeps changing with this, but this basically is like golden black and cream. So it's that like great Gatsby kind of style that Graphic 45 is known for in a bunch of its stuff. So I just love that aspect of it and had to buy it for that reason. My hand looks so red. It's not that red, I promise you. Um, That's crazy. So yeah, those were two must have buys at um, Impressive Ideas on Spalding Drive in Atlanta. Go, it's amazing. The entire staff is just perfect. Okay. So now we're going to talk about Hobby Lobby craziness because they're in the middle of their 50% off paper studios shenanigans. Um, and so for whatever reason, my love of washi tape will not go away. I don't think it ever will. It's a problem. Wow, that made them look so much prettier and brighter just tapping on them. I love that feature about stupid freaking phones. Um, okay, so this is my baby one that I got. And it was a very last minute kind of buy, but I thought, how cute would that look for like a December layout with Christmas stuff? I just was like, ah, uh, flannel and polka dots, like two things I love. Why the heck not? Um, my favorite buy was this. Okay, maybe not my favorite because there's a lot of favorites here, but this is impressive. Because of the fact that, I don't know about you guys, but I'm having a really hard time finding color tape that actually matches real colors like they're either too Crayola or too like vivid that they don't make any sense um so yeah hey sorry I had to take a quick break and get my food out of the oven or else it would burn and then the house would burn down and that wouldn't be cute and would ruin the video so thanks for your patience um for the five second break in the videos um okay so these are all decorative tapes from Paper Studios, obviously. Um, it was basically like buy one, get one free, so I went a little crazy. Um, I love the bright colors in this. I thought that was just phenomenal. Plus, I have a problem with polka dots, so. And stripes. And floral. And all things girly. I loved that. This is really cute and very, like, um, boho. Very, like, anthropo- Like, that girl shops at Anthropology. That girl shops at Free People. Okay, that girl shops at Fabric and Lily Pulitzer. This girl is BCBG, maybe. I love how I'm comparing them to clothing because that's hilarious. Hi, Binks. Um, I love this because you're going to see a sticker packet later on that matches that vibe. Um, I have so much stuff that will go with this. Like, to me, that's super um, Tim Holtz even, that, that person, that crafter. This is very... Um, Heidi Swap um, to me, which I love. And then I've got more sticker packets over there that make sense for that. So you'll see that in a minute. This, for whatever reason, was like fun holiday girl to me. Like I can definitely see me using like some of these for holiday layouts, which I loved. Um, I just really like that. Like even like some of these banners that say like hello and then the wild and free. I just loved. This one was on sale which I really liked. Um, 
from, it was a back to school one, which I, I don't know. I feel like I saw this, but I didn't get it. So I was really glad to see that on sale. This is another one of those like awesome buys. Um, if I can get it to focus, that would be even better. Um, they're all little binder clips. Um, you're going to see this in a minute. This like banner style that, um, uh, maybe started doing with their planner stuff because like these banners match up. So you can buy this sticker packet with these clips. There's a washi tape roll. I think there's even like a pin holder. There's all these different things that go with this banner and they're all color coded, which I'm like, that is the most genius thing ever. Now I just need them to make stamps to go with each one. Now they do have some like roller stamps that match the layouts. I'm not saying that because there already are some like that. I'm talking like clear stamps, like a whole section, like packet of them that I would love to see because that would make me super happy because I feel like that's the one thing we're missing right now is a lot of people are going out and buying stamps that match like I bought mine from Avery L or from Law and Fawn to kind of go with stuff. But there's like that one little bracket or there's not like stickers that look like this kind of thing. So it makes it kind of weird sometimes. These are Mambi. And I got this sticker sheet to go with this roll of washi tape. And also I think maybe that roll. I don't know. I think it was just that one that I got it for. Because, like, this to me is all, like, a perfect go-together. And I tried to be better at that this time. And I'm going to try to in the future to kind of shop that way. Not only for money's sake, but for um, my sanity. So I don't have to go back out and get something else for the layout. Because I don't know about you guys, but I'll be in the middle of a layout and then be like, crap, I need blah, blah, blah. And I didn't get it. And so now I have to go back and get it. Which sucks. So I got that. I got this, obviously. Um, this is so stinking cute. I'm going to try to do this one-handed. But look, it even has, like, all the little banners. And I'm like, that's the cutest thing I've ever seen. I love that. Like, it's literally meant to function as, like, a full-on like set almost like you could oh my gosh Christmas gift ideas right here people like if you bought somebody the planner with all of the like banner types that match it um you'd probably have a best friend for life right there at least if that was me I'd want all that okay um I did yeah that's my shoe um I got this um paper I love this um, and it matches the Wild and Free. By the way, they are going to suck me dry financially because there is a organization box that matches. Where is it? If I don't pass it. They have ones that are leopard print like that. They also have boxes like that right now that are for storage and I love that. And then there was also like a light baby pink. If they had had two of them, I would have bought them all. Um, that and an endless supply fortune. Um, then I got this one to, okay, so that's not gonna happen. Oh, it's cause it won't fold back at the top. I love these. This is just the coolest thing ever. I love that page. That whole page. I love clear stickers. It's a problem. This is so neat. Um, I got this to go with this right here. And kind of a little bit of that and a little bit of that. Um, the This roll right here would also look really pretty with this because it has a lot of that rose gold in it. This was that like really random like set that I bought, but I love it to go with my unicorn stamp because it's got that like holographic vibe. Like that unicorn and this screams like I died and went to Lisa Frank um, all over again. That's so funny. Like I love this. 
nap time. Oh, can I have that like in a stamp to put in a plan? Okay, so I love that. These are all like really good bags. Um, they'll go really well with the ones I already kind of showed you that, but they'll go with um. These are gonna go great with the stamps I bought last week that already have like the blocks and stuff. There, I'm gonna have way too much fun with this like all these new sticker packets. That's a problem. Okay, so. I have to buy another one of these because I feel like I'll use it more than once. I'm not planning to use it in the planner because that's just not realistic. Actually, I could. I could do like a 12-day countdown. That's a good idea. Oh, I'm going to get that. Um, but I want to use it in like a Project Life layout or something because my mom and I keep joking about turning this song into 12 days of Christmas for my kitten. Um, I think we already made a calendar with her in it. Um we love my kitten. She is like the grandchild. She is my child. She is so much sass. It's unreal. You guys see that in other videos that I do, but she's grown up so much. And, um, yeah, we just started joking about 12 days of Christmas for the cat. So I bought, I saw that and I was like done sold. Um, and it being 50% off just helped it out a little bit more. This is really cute. I like this for this tape. A lot. I think that that's going to go really well together. Plus, I had some flamingo um, stickers that have a lot of, like, rose gold vibe to them. Um, I'm a big print person. So, that's why, like, when I found the big roll of tape. And there's still colors in here that I'm not getting, like, enough of. Like, I don't feel like that's navy enough. Or, like, that baby pink is perfect. But, like, I love to see that teal. You see kind of those purples. I just love that this is probably the most realistic solid color set I've seen in all of this. Because a lot of these companies are not doing your generic Crayola colors. They give you the brighter pinks. They give you the softer pinks. They're going to give you the teals, that flamingo pink. They're going to give you the Lisa Frank color. They're not going to give you your generic stuff. So I love all of this. I think this was a very successful purchase across the board. If you have any questions, comment below. Sorry about the, about the break in the video. There, words I can talk. Um, and I'm so excited to be back. You guys have no idea how happy and normal I feel just being able to film stuff again. And especially with it being in the holiday season, a time when I'm typically like swamped, I actually am trying to just take time to do this because it makes me feel amazing. So if there's anything in particular you guys want to see me craft or know about or do a tutorial on, please comment below. I'd love to hear your responses and love to be more involved and give you guys what you want. Thanks so much, and I hope everyone has an amazing Thanksgiving tomorrow. Bye.